the howl of the wolf fills a lonely canyon high above the desert land. They call Chicote. The flint strikes a steel, a cloud conceals a final stand, and the noble fall. Stay safe, stay warm, and you stay free with Chicote Outdoor Recreation. Hey, Bill here with Chicote Outdoor Recreation. So I'm out here, I'm out here with Herb Port. He is the brand new star of the HBO miniseries, Jim Beckworth, the biography. Uh, he plays the young Jim Beckworth. I think it's just going to be an off-the-hook film. I agreed to technically advise on this because they're going to hold to historical accuracy. You know, they're going to talk about the good and the bad of Jim Beckworth and his life, his early life especially. And that's where Herb is playing. Herb is playing the young Jim Beckworth when he first got on the Ashley Expedition uh, with Jim Bridger, with all those guys. It's going to be very historically accurate. So we're teaching him how to muzzle over. We're doing some things out here in the wild. We're going to be living off the land out here for 45 days because he method acts a little bit and he's learned quite a bit already. Um, you're gonna see him shoot the muzzle loader. you're gonna see him start a fire with flint and steel, all the things that we've been working on for this past week. It's a whole modification process, so there may not be a lot of videos from Chicote Outdoor Recreation for a while. As I said, we'll be out here for, for a good 45 days learning things. But a brilliant actor, you probably recognize him from Cats, you probably recognize him from Mamma Mia. Here is, here is Herb Port. Herb, let me ask you something. Uh, fire when, away. When you got the scholarship from NYU to go to Juilliard, what prompted you to do that? Well, actually, um, believe it or not, it was actually a, a woman. I went out there for a woman named Anne Marie. And, uh, you know, sadly, that actually didn't work out, you know, just like most things. Mm. But, um, yeah, it was an amazing time. I actually got out there. Uh, we lasted maybe two months after that, and I just continued on with uh, school and uh, acting, dreams of uh, Broadway and, you know, Hollywood and stuff like that. So what was it like when you when you you know when you got the call you found out you'd be playing Jim Beckworth? Um, that is a major part historical. Uh, this this film will be legendary. You know that. What was it like when you got that call? You'd gone through the the interview process. You'd gone through the auditions. I'm sure a lot of people read for that part. When you got that call, that had to be off the hook, wasn't it? You know what? Uh, yeah, it was definitely a boost in confidence, motivation. I'm really glad that you guys actually reached out to me. I'm more than excited to hop out here and actually play the role, come out here and live the life, learn the things. He's an amazing guy, Jim Beckworth. Craziest story of probably anyone that I can possibly, you know, imagine. It's, it's absolutely amazing. I know there's a lot of competition. You know, the fact that I'm here to do it, absolutely amazing. I'm ready to bring it. Well, you know, you, you've got the three episodes of his life. You've got the young Jim Beckworth that you play. I guess that's the first six or seven episodes. And then you've got Midlife, that's Denzel Washington. You've got The End, which is, uh, I think Morgan Freeman is, is reading for that right now. And two great guys to work with. I can tell you, Denzel, great sense of humor. Um, when he was working on a movie, Glory, it's a Civil War film. He used to call me for technical advice and just, just a great sense of humor on him. Whereas Morgan, uh, once he's in character, I don't care if you're at the sandwich cart, Morgan's in character. I still call him Sarge of the State from Glory because once he goes into character, he goes into character. And I think it's just gonna be phenomenal to see these three actors really bring Jim Beckworth to, to life. So hey, uh, keep watching, make sure you watch that on HBO, and uh, we'll get with you in a little bit. Until then, this is Bill with Chicote Outdoor Recreation saying, you stay safe, you stay warm, you keep yourself free.
Stay safe, stay warm, stay free.